everybody, my name is Vector, and welcome back to Super Mario 64. Last time, we had Egg Custer join us in co-op mode so that way we could collect 50 stars. This time, we are going to open the 50 star door. What an event. What could be behind it? Reactive to the star power, the door slowly opens. We've got more things here. Wowie. Hello. There's something strange about that clock. As you jump inside, watch the position of the big hand. Oh, look what I found. Here, Luigi. Catch. Ah, uh, another star. Thank you, Toad. Here we go! Wow, another power star. Luigi gains more courage for the power of the castle. Okay. No, oh, wait, hold on. Hold on, guys. Sorry about that. Something yeah. happened. So, obviously, there's a clock and uh, two holes out to the side, but there's also this door. To open the door that leads to the endless stairs. You need 70 stars. Bwah! <laughs> Oh, clearly we don't. Let's just walk up it. Man, this is a long staircase. How far down? Are we? How far up are we? Oh. Oh. Wonderful. Alright then, guess we gotta collect 70 more stars. Yeah, yeah, I can. Shut up. There is another star I forgot to grab. Owie. So before we head into that clock or fucking whatever the fuck. Don't know why you need a clock that big. I got a toad. Uh Okay, that was weird. Game froze for a second. There we go. Oh, no, wrong toad. Talk. Speak. Yeah, I don't give a damn. Give me a star. Oh, swing. Cool. Don't save. No saving. Alright. Now we enter the star. Now we go through the star door. We enter the clock. This one. Course 14, Tick Tock Clock. Star 1, rolling into the cage. Welcome to Tick Tock Clock. A lot of people don't like this course. I personally think it's alright. It does have a banger of a Mario Kart track, though. Oh. Fortunately, I chose a bad character to go into Tick Tock Clock. What was the name of the star? Roll into the cage. Alright. Fortunately, we'll be doing our tradition of just collecting two stars like this. What? I still have to endure two stars with Luigi. Uh, these are the, these next two courses that we have just gained access to are the most unfair of the uh, courses in the game. The most frustrating. Go, we rolled into the cage. Wait for it. There we go. You may be, if you're wondering why. Oh, petting the pendulums. If you're wondering, if you can't tell, if you're wondering why I decided to uh, wait until the minute hand was on the 12 there, that's because, uh, depending on where the minute hand is, is pointing, when you enter the when you enter TikTok clock, uh, the mechanisms will either be completely stopped, be going, be moving slowly, be moving quickly, or be moving randomly. Personally, I like them be I like them being stopped or moving slowly. Now, of course, exploiters really like it when they are random because. There's a lot of things you can exploit in this stage if you have them as random. Oh 
So much that there's a one up. Oh god. I needed that. Oh, okay. Careful. And there we go. Another star coin. Here we go. <sighs> Pet the pendulum is complete. Now let's take a break from adventuring the inside of a clock and instead. That goes I want. Instead we're gonna head into this area. Specifically. Yay, yay, yay. Course 15, Rainbow Ride. Star 1, Cruiser Crossing the Rainbow. This is the other really unfair course, because... Welcome to the waiting game! This is what you get to do, you get to wait as you cross and can't damn thing. You get to hear this, you get to listen to the slider. I hope you like slider, because that's the main song. I always feel like, I always felt as though each course in this game should have had unique music. You know, I feel like in any game, each level he should have a unique song to go along with it. I can understand why you'd want to, you know, kind of save on space, you'd want to, you know, reuse music tracks so that way you could save on space and stuff, but... I like having variety, you know? If my game's a little bit bigger than if I had be used to song, so what? Besides, my games wouldn't be big at all. It'd probably be a little small adventures. No, it'd be. Oh, no! Ow. Oh, there we go. First death of the third floor. I think. I mean, third, first death of the, uh, of Tick Tock Clock and Rainbow Ride. Okay, we're fine. Ah, ho. That is a long reach. Uh oh. Well, there goes my ride. All the way down there. I missed again! I'll cut to when... I'll, I'll just... I'll just cut to when we actually get back to where I was. Cut. Crossing fucking thing. Why are you up here? You don't usually get up there. Okay, fucking whatever. Okay, we're back. Okay, watch out, blue fire. I don't know if it hurts more than red fire. It's just a different color. Squeeze. <laughs> well, you can say it's a different color about a lot of things. Yeah. Oh, look at that! Look at the wings—they're flying, flying wings. 
What is Christ? It's not the boat that's flying, it's the wings. Okay, he uses those wings to make some mean barbecue, I'm telling you, man. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, yay! Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Okay. Alright. The first star of Rainbow Ride collected, finally. Alright. Cruiser crossing the rainbow done. Let's grab one more. Star 2, the big house in the sky. Guess what we get to do again? That's right! Waiting time. Shut up, phone. I'll uh, cut to when we actually. I'll cut to when we get back to that cross section. Okay, we're back, and so is the Lakitu. Seriously, why is he here? Alright, we need to go on this one this time. Ooh, variety! Ooh, don't show it to the Apple users! <laughs> I will make fun of everybody! Except for my family and friends, I love them very much. But I will make fun of my friends, because that's what I do, on a daily basis! Uh, uh, this, after playing this game, this song's gonna be fucking drilled into my brain. Because I've played the- I'm playing this, this game three times. First time I played this game was so that way I could get used to playing Render 96, and I collected all 120 stars. Now I'm playing it for a Let's Play, and I'm playing on Super Mario 3D All-Stars. So, this song's gonna be fucking burned into my memory, and it's only gonna be made worse when I get a uh, Super Mario Maker too. That one. Oh, it started flashing. It started going blink blonk. I also love how they did, like, the blinking effect, because it's literally, like, the model is just despawning. Is it, like, being made invisible, and then being made visible again? Hey! No, no. Get back up here! God damn it! No! Fuck! Oh, wonderful. Oh, this is horrible. God damn it. Is there a way to get up there? No, I don't think there is. God damn it. Why? Why? Uh. Okay, hold on.
Okay, I made it up here. Don't ask how, I refuse to explain. Wait, hold on. Okay, I made it up here. Uh, don't ask how, I refuse to explain. Just grab our star and get out of here. Okay, well that'll do it this that will do it for this episode of Super Mario 64. Uh next time who knows what we'll fucking get. We'll probably grab enough we'll probably begin our quest of grabbing enough stars to uh go through the endless staircase. Uh maybe we'll see what's behind this hole. Uh anyway. I'll uh, see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye!